Earth Lunar Classic Value Prediction, LUNC rises 3%, will the rally continue? Today the value of Terra Luna Classic, LUNC, rose to the level of $0.00013313, with an increase of 3% in the last 24 hours, after the rally of the rest of the market yesterday. Despite the gains of the day before, the current value of LUNC marks a loss of 6% in the last week and a decline of 19% in the last 30 days, at a time when the main cryptocurrencies, such as BTC and ETH, are rising in the same time frames. However, yesterday's rally underscores the possibility of further gains for LUNC, which has already risen just over 13,000% from its all-time low of $0.0000000999967, touched in May 2022. As USDC's $1 peg plans are under development, it may only be a matter of time before large amounts of LUNC are burned, causing the value of the crypto to spike. Earth Lunar Classic Value Prediction, LUNC rises 3% The LUNC chart reveals some promising indicators. Both the Relative Strength Index, in purple, and the 30-day Moving Average, in red, are performing interestingly. Its 30-day average has started to rise sharply towards the 200-day average, in blue. And if the shorter average exceeds the longer one, the crypto could be in a breakout phase. LUNC's RSI has also risen to 70 in recent days, after being below 30 in the last week, indicating an excess of sales. Despite having fallen in the last few hours, it is still around 60, signaling a decent upward momentum. The key resistance level for LUNC is located at $0.000135. If the token manages to pass this level, it could make further gains in the coming days. Given the poor performance of LUNC over the last week and in the last month, it can be said that the stock is currently oversold and could therefore record a significant rise in the coming weeks. This suspicion is supported by ongoing attempts to carry out the process of burning LUNC and cause an increase in its price, with the acceptance in February of a proposal to repeg the sister stablecoin of LUNC, USTC. The reason this is good for Terra Luna Classic is that it would require large-scale burning of LUNC tokens. As the token is used to adjust the price of USTC, it would then create a more efficient system for LUNC and USTC, able to burn more than the tax rate can reach. Burning a greater number of tokens is necessary if LUNC is to come even remotely close to its previous price, given that so far only 48.6 billion LUNC has been burned, out of an availability of about 5.9 trillion. That is why the proposal is so important, but a plan to put it into practice has yet to be agreed. In addition, the Terra Luna Classic community is continuing to work on other proposals to increase the value of LUNC. Among these is the proposal to increase the tax burn on chain from the current rate of 0.5% to 0.8%, which would cause an increase in the number of LUNCs taken out of circulation. Another proposal, however, suggests changing the breakdown of the tax burn so that 25%, instead of 10%, of what is burned goes to fund developers. This would help boost the development of Terra Luna Classics blockchain, helping to make its ecosystem and applications more attractive to users and projects. As positive as these proposals may be, they have also aroused dissent in the community, with some validators opposed to the idea of increasing the tax rate burn to 0.8%. In addition, there is another proposal to remove a developer from the task force tasked with supporting the growth of the Terra Luna Classic ecosystem. This whole situation shows why LUNC has not been able to recover with momentum, and also why the community has not been able to reach a concrete plan for the USTC repeg. The good news is that the burn rate has definitely increased in recent weeks, with Binance having resumed burning trading fees and revealing that it had burned 8 billion LUNC in the three months before the end of February. Due to this gradual increase in the burning process, there is a good chance that LUNC could reach $0.00015 in the coming weeks with $0.0002 as the next target. From that level, it has a real chance of returning to $0.0004 or $0.0005 by the end of 2023, if the market continues to recover. A more substantial gain depends on the mobilization of the Terra Luna Classic community in favor of a specific plan for the USTC repeg, which could cause LUNC to soar if and when it comes to fruition.